Hey guys, Indigo Priestess here. Hope everybody is feeling amazing. I wanted to touch on the state that you should be in when invoking or evoking demonic entities. There seems to be a lot of people out there. Ones that have reached out to me and have reached out to other cultists who have tried to explain how to connect with an entity. Anyone can connect with an entity. The problem is not everyone can shut down the thought processing that blocks you from connecting to the entity. So before I continue and teach you how you can shut down that processing that blocks you from connecting to the demonic entity, I just wanted to introduce myself. I am a spellcaster life coach. I teach people how to invoke and evoke all forms of entities, but specifically demonic entities. How to operate from awareness, hypnotherapy, and the list goes on. All my information is in the description box below this video. So when you are trying to invoke or evoke, using different types of techniques, there are amazing techniques out there from different occultists on YouTube, um, specifically on YouTube, TikTok, um, you know, that you can, that can help you connect with an entity. The problem is people's minds are busy. Their minds are busy and they seem to think that the thoughts that they have is them. And when you are looking at a manual on how to invoke or evoke, and you're trying to evoke and invoke from that manual, you are then no longer connecting with an entity from your soul slash awareness. You are connecting or trying, attempting to connect with the entity from your mind. You're not going to connect to anything from your mind. I can assure you of that. The brain is a navigator. The brain navigates the earth ship. You are the observer. When you are not invoking from an observer standpoint, you're not going to reach the entity. So the best way to, if you want to invoke or evoke a demonic entity, it is through meditation. Quieting the mind, understanding that you can only hear spirit when you operate from your spirit. You're not going to hear them any other way. You need to be in your spirit or operating from your spirit to connect with a spirit. Okay? In order for proper quantum entanglement to take place, that is the state you need to be in. And in order to be in that state, you need to practice meditation, which is just going to involve quieting the mind for 15 minutes a week. So that is for three days a week, five minutes, five minutes, five minutes, maybe on a Monday, five minutes on a Wednesday, and then five minutes on a Friday. And the more you learn to keep to shut the mind down and to keep the mind quiet for that five minutes, you will reach a level of spirituality you never thought possible. Because now you are teaching the brain, you make the rules. And you are leaving space for the soul to come through. When this starts to happen, connecting with any spirit will become easy. Give meditation a try. That's all I want to tell you guys. If you want more content, like and subscribe for more. But bye for now.